Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to another video. In today's video, I'll show you guys how to make a Roblox executor. It will take around 10 minutes because we're actually gonna make a little small UI. So, like, we're not gonna spend a lot of time on it, but like, yeah, let's just get into it. First step, of course, go to the Discord server. The link will be in the description and on the comments. Uh, after that, I just want to scroll down until you see um, uh, make executor right here. And uh, hold on. You want to click on this one right here. All right, so we're gonna download uh one, two, three, four. All right, four stuff we're gonna download. And um, yeah, if you have uh, Visual Studio already, please skip the video. Oh, don't skip the video. I mean, like uh, skip to time right here. All right, so for the people that have Visual Studio, go on to your um go on to your Microsoft Store and download Visual Studio Installer. As you can see, it's right here. And what you want to do, you want to go ahead and open it. And you want to download Visual Studio 22 Community or the pre preview version. You want to go ahead and for you, it will be showing up like this. And what you want to do, for you it will be showing up like this. Please do not click on anything else. Just this one right here, .NET Development. After you've done that, you just want to go ahead and install it. And yeah, click on create a new project and it will open up this little thing. And you want to search for a template over here. Windows forms app right here. And we're click on Windows Forms app.net the framework. Right here. Do not click on this one. It's a simple mistake people click on. Click on this one right here. Go ahead and click on next and enter your project now. I'm gonna name it YouTube Cool Tutorial. There we go. Free. Alright, so here we got the form. Uh, what you want to do is go ahead and change the back color to black. I like the color black. And we we'll also put the form border style to none. And if you're new, again, if you don't have toolbox, solution explorer pro uh, properties, you, you want to go ahead and click on view. Solution explorer properties, windows, and toolbox. Put them how I put them. And uh, you can use your mouse wheel to your like mouse scrolling thing to like choose what you want. Go for the nun and uh, size it how you like it. I like the size of it because we're not gonna make a cool UI, so we're just gonna do it like this. Right click over here, manage like packages. Go ahead and click on browse and type gonna and click on gonna UI to Windows Forms. Click on this. <laughs> After this is finished on the output, you want to go ahead and go on forms one. And now we're gonna type button. You want to drag a button over here. Right after you have put in the button, it will show up this little stupid thing. Just so go ahead and wait for six seconds. While we wait for that, we can go ahead and go to Discord again and download CZK PNG. After you download that, you want to go ahead and go to uh, Monaco over here. Download this. Click on download. And uh, go back over here and download CZK API Velocity. Alright, so after you've done all of these, go back over here and um, click on image right here. Make sure you're on project resource file, import. Go to where you have CZK PNG. I have extracted it already. I'm gonna go ahead and double click on the executor icon. Control A, open. And we're gonna um, type, go on the keyboard and press um, P for play button. Click on OK. It will take a few seconds to load everything, so just wait. There we go. Now everything has loaded. As you can see, we can go to text and remove the text and make the back fill color to black and make the button like that. All right. And now what we're gonna do is uh, what we're gonna do? Uh, let's make the size to 50, 50, 50. 
and the image size to 25, 25, just like this. Actually, we can do 55 now. It's a good thing. Go 54, 54, and now we're gonna go to um shadow decoration. If we go ahead and go ahead and go ahead and go, hold on, hold on. If you go ahead and click on shadow decoration and add the color um uh 40 40 40 this yeah let's do that um and quick enable or like use your mouse wheel like i told you and go back oh go back to fill color and then boom and then um we're gonna go ahead and add a border radius to five is five good okay five is not good um Eight. It is wonderful. And go back to the shadow decoration and add a border radius eight. I see if you look a little bit close, you have a little glow. And let's go ahead and add a panel. And um, this panel, we're gonna size it around like this. And place it in here. And size it how you like it. This. This stupid little thing will show up, don't worry about it. This will not affect anything when we start the project. Alright, so now what we're gonna do, we're gonna make this black. We're gonna make it black and um, copy that. Actually don't copy it. Go back to um shot of the creation, enable false, and um, there we go. So now we're gonna go look for cl click E, no C actually for clear. And now we got that. Now we're gonna add another one. Make sure you can use Control C and Control V. Now we're gonna do F for folder. Copy that. And um, do D. Hold on. I'm gonna do D for the skit. Actually, no, do not copy anymore. Copy this one. And there we go. Looks wonderful. Okay. Um. So after we did that, uh, on this one we're gonna do um. Let's do which one do we do? Uh, S for sign out. Hold on, we gotta find sign out. Or E for exit. No, sign out. Right, right here. We got sign out. We got everything we need. Um. So now what we're gonna do on this thing right here, we're gonna add 40, 40, 40. Border radius to um, 20 and uh, border thing just to 1. Alright, looks wonderful, looks great. Uh, hold on, I actually don't. Alright, now we're gonna. You can use your error keys to move the stuff around, just like this. And yeah, alright, let's go ahead and start it up and just check out how it looks like. Alright, so here we got it and um, for me, it kind of looks nice, but well, you got one mistake over here. Um, it is the uh, the buttons. So just you will be hover over. It looks stupid. Let's go ahead and fix that right now. All right, so go to all of the buttons, and uh, we're gonna add something called a animation on it. Animation true. And after that, we wanna put this all the way to the top. And what we're gonna do now, we're gonna add something called a web browser. We're gonna fill out the whole thing. Like we're gonna full fill the whole thing with this thing. Don't worry, the color is gonna go straight to black, so it will match your theme. Don't worry, guys. And bring that to front. There we go. And now what we're gonna do? Uh, we're gonna add. We're gonna copy this and um, hold on. Fucking piece. All right. So now we wanna Control C and co uh, Control V and um. Make it how you like it. So I'm gonna make it around 20. I'm gonna put it as around 20 and 15. And um, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna make it 39, 39. And we're gonna go over here. C for close. Copy it. And copy it. There we go. And on this one, we're gonna do M for maximize and um, on this one we do M for click right here minimize so now we've got the buttons over here and uh, so now 
I'm gonna add a logo of my choice. So give me a few seconds and I'm gonna look for a logo. Turns out I don't wanna look for a logo because I have my own logo. So let's go ahead and add that in. You wanna go ahead and click on import and go to the logo that you want. Alright, so I added my logo over here. I'm gonna make the image size how you want it. I'm gonna make it around um, 40 40. Oops, um, let's click. Alright, so there we go. And um, so this is how it is. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna. Um, oh my god, bro. Okay, shit. Alright. We're gonna go over here and. Um, did an anima animated false, and we're gonna go to hover state. We're gonna type black on everything, or whatever your back color is. Black. Black and um, yeah, all right. So the that's taken care of now. Um, so now we're gonna get into coding. So lock in. All right. So first thing is when you have downloaded CZK API that you load, you just wanna go ahead and add that in your project. Please fucking add it. All right. Now you just wanna go ahead and click on browse and um, go to your downloads and look for CZK API. And I'm just gonna go ahead and click add. And we're gonna click OK. Alright, so now that we have added CTK API, we can go ahead and go back to my server. And, um, fucking computer. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and. Oh, Alright. What you wanna do is copy this thing over here. And go back over here. Motherfuck. Oh, bro. Just let. Oh, my. Alright, so we wanna go back to your uh, project and double click on. Some some place round the place please all right and just paste this in okay oh my fucking god all right okay okay good 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 uh we're gonna copy all this and um enter enter paste and uh go back over here copy this and um uh, in here boom and now we're gonna go um, over here, copy all this, and go over here, um, where do we go again? Oh, okay, add, and um, we go over here, we go to general, uh, okay, general, app application manifest file, add, and over here, we're gonna paste this in. Boom, there we go, there we go. Wonderful, wonderful. And we're gonna go to um, copy this. And um, size it around like that. And we're gonna click, we're gonna type A for attach. And image size to um, 20 to 23. Okay. Alright. We're gonna do it like that. Alright. Looks wonderful. Looks wonderful. And um, now we're gonna do. Uh, what are we gonna do again? I forgot. Alright. Double click on this and click. Uh, and type inject. Inject and boom. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and click on this. On this. Type Windows. Uh, Window, please, bro, just let me. Window state. The equals form. Form window. Window state. Minimized. Wait, am I tripping? Hold on. Oh, this is supposed to be the close button. Alright, just copy all this. Copy all this and type um, application. The exit. Boom, boom, boom. And go over here. Paste that in. Go over here. Paste this in. But this one we type maximize. There we go. So now we got all these buttons fixed. Working. On this one now. Alright. We're gonna get started on this in a few minutes. Hold on. In a few seconds. Alright. So now we're gonna go to make executor again. We're gonna go to simple Monaco. Download this thing over here if you don't have it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and. So you want to download it and extract it, 
and go to your downloads or where you have downloaded it and um hold on all right so you have i have it over here you gotta click um extract all extract all okay battery remember make sure that you are on open file which i just told you right here click on this monaco i'm gonna copy that close this go back over here bin debug and then um hey spot will stop opening random shit there we go all right so we got medical medical yo i'm so cool we got monaco and um we're gonna go over here your phone that load i'm gonna go go ahead and copy this double click over here all right and now it's gonna show one error and please don't cry in the comments just go ahead and click on this and name web browser nope editor and um you see this fixed um uh this is the clear it's the same thing to be honest what the clear button does this is my folder hold on f folder all right there we go clear paste that in and um this is open file and copy that go over here open file and copy this for save file go over here and paste this in and uh, this one we're actually I'm just gonna keep there it, it there for like um, design 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 purposes and now we're gonna do the execute button and um, we're gonna go over here and paste this in instead of core functions you know what just delete all of this bro do CZK funk and uh, execute bro come on script boom 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 all right guys um you finally have your own executor uh no 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 hold on you don't have your executor yet hold on how do i start are you going to go ahead and click on uh cancel and go over here and go to um and type uh ellipse hold on ellipse put that in and we're gonna put shadow shadow form we're gonna put drag. Bro, where, where are you going, boy? Alright, so now we're gonna go to chunk control for one. Transferable drag, false. And we're gonna go to shadow form. Boom. Boom. So. No, 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 not editor. Hold on. For. There we go. Alright, uh, now we can go ahead and click on start and uh, do whatever we want actually. Click on restart under the different credentials, I don't know. Yes, now we're gonna go ahead and click on start. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Now we're gonna click start. Finally, gang. Oh my god. Works now. Open file. Everything works. Uh, Inject works, but I'm too lazy to try it out, guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. I'm so happy to end this video. Thank you so much for I love you guys so much. Thank you for everything. Bye bye.